Boss Rush update is in alpha, and that does mean just, just the boss rush. It also does have a couple of new items here, too, which I'll be looking at right now. We got the Paraglyph, increases your combo the more you get hit, and then Taunt, which, I mean, I don't know if I'm going to be using that too much in this, in this run, but here it is. <laughs> anyway, yeah, this is not even a melee weapon, so it's not really going to be getting too much use out of that anyway. All right, I'm gonna take a guess right now. Probably in here if I'm looking for the... Yep, and yep, there we are. Oh, no, no, that's regular fighting. I'm, I'm guessing the gigantic red skull is probably the one I'm looking for vis-a-vis uh, -vis bosses. <laughs> okay, so just slightly reworked in the way that you find everything now. Good enough. And the daily. All right. Oh, supposed to be an entire host of different challenges and even modifiers that you can put on the bosses. So that's going to be interesting. And in fact, I am going to be doing exactly that. I mean, it wasn't that long ago. All right, it was like two months ago or something that I did the whole go through the bosses, kind of talking about everything that I know about fighting them. So it's really going to be a lot of that same sort of thing. But if I can really up the challenge even... Wow, look at that. But uh, if I can up the challenge even more, maybe it'll be... Something. Also, the Beheaded. I believe that's the first time that anybody in the game has ever actually referred to the character as the Beheaded. <laughs> you know, that's that's been like something that... Uh, as an unofficial type of name for the main character. But here we finally have it said out loud. Yeah, that's for true. I don't know, I feel like Yan was so, was warming up to me, maybe a little bit. Ah, yes. It is a good statue. It's a quite a good statue, really. So I guess it gets improved. Yeah, alright. Alright. Okay, sure. Not really going to be able to actually, you know, save any of the progress that I'm doing in the alpha version, but that'll be something to look at a little bit later. This looks like each one of the bosses... You know, given that there's like a rose there and everything. <laughs> then more giant skeletons of creatures that do not appear in the game. Sort of like that giant snake. Alright, what are we looking at here? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Which one? Which one? Statue outfits is the new end game. I still haven't even gotten the regular outfit. Speaking of which, uh, going back and taking a look at the custom mode here. There are, uh, there are more outfits to be gotten, too. Which I guess I didn't, uh, yeah, I didn't turn on the enable random outfit and everything, so didn't get them here. So, so new, so fresh off the, off the presses that they don't even have descriptions or names yet. <laughs> All right. Let's get in with this. I guess we're just gonna start left to right. I mean, how else am I gonna do this? And how do I get to choose my loadout? Or is it just the things that I already... Okay, here we go. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm feeling saucy. Okay, okay. So we get a standard loadout. All right, so it's this sort of thing. Makes sense. And then... Uh, what to choose... I mean, I was using the infantry bow last time, like two weeks ago since I've gotten caught up in Stardew Valley right now. I hope you're all enjoying the combination of me trying to struggle to figure out something to say about farming and also 70s albums for some reason. I don't really know how that became a, a theme, but it is. You know what? Here, I do like the machete and pistol. That's a fun weapon. And corrupted power, overall, pretty good item. Now, did I really want to go melee for this? No, but... What can I say? Yeah, machete and pistol already taken. Sandal does have some new stuff here. Then other, other new thing on top of everything else. You got this. Sort of like YOLO. Except, honestly, probably a lot better than YOLO. <laughs> that is, that is an item. Very picky and choosy about how you'd end up wanting to use it, though. Uh, for right now, I think uh, best idea here... I don't even have anything good for support. Wow. 
There's actually not a whole lot of good stuff that I have. So I guess give me crow's foot and uh, ta tactical retreat. Ah, let's see what happens. Oh boy, could have probably used that before. And I mean, there's also a few new legendary affixes. The one that I saw was that getting with the Spartan sandals, you can get a a super kick if you get a legendary, which seems pretty cool. Oh, look, it's also got a, a purple. I don't really think that that's too different, but hey, look, purple health bar. It's purple, everybody. Isn't that cool? Okay, you know what? Let's just do that. Do this. Oh, yeah. Corrupted power doing the good work here. Okay, stop yelling. <laughs> wow. Yeah, corrupted power doing some good work here, I think. But as it is... No. Whatever. <laughs> that was... I, I want to say that we are currently looking at zero boss cells. Ooh, I'll take that. Probably instead of smoke bomb. And ice crossbow? Oh, but it's like level one ice crossbow. Let's keep the stuff that I already got. A little bit more powerful than that. Do I get legendary items now? That was a perfect fight. What's the super kick do? Further knockback? I don't know. <laughs> I just saw that in the patch notes that there is a super kick. It's super kicky. Ow. All right. Funny joke. Get out of here, you. I mean, I guess I could have done that for a little bit extra challenge, but let's be honest here. Eh. Legendary money shooter? Oh, yeah, that's got to be pretty good. That's got to be pretty, really good. Streets of Rage reference? Wait, what? I missed that. I'm always looking for Streets of Rage references. Uh, anyway, let's see me die here now, as it's the Scarecrow. Oh, boy. Actually, no, I'm doing pretty good here. <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, sure, sure, whatever. Working out well. Working out well. I wonder if you can get the perfect boss fights in, uh... We didn't get the perfect boss fights in, in this mode. <laughs> Scarecrow dead. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll say. All right. Good fight. Good fight. <laughs> New update's so cool. Ice Giant is so amazing. Oh, I haven't even gotten to, like, uh, remixed bosses. I saw that that was a thing. Uh, that there are, like, changed up versions. But, eh, maybe this could be good. Yeah, sure. Like, obviously, they do give you the ability to, yeah, upgrade some of this. Oh, you know what? Sure. I, I can make that work. Considering this is like zero boss cell difficulty. I don't know if you have to change the boss cells here or elsewhere, but <laughs> we'll see. Oh, boy. Jeez. Ah, da, ah, jeez. Oh, man. Ooh. I couldn't possibly backfire. <laughs> yeah, especially right now. <laughs> Although this is just the this is just the final part. It is not the full climb up the lighthouse. That said, we are still talking about the the guardian fight, which is well, you know what the guardian fight is. Oh my god! How are you not dead? <laughs> anyway. There's one. Two times damage, barber. There's that. Ah, oh. challenge the servants in the fight room. So I got good at parrying everything. Yeah, I mean parrying. Of course, it's like I am still so impressed at how much, like how much uh more people are doing parrying. I remember it was just. Back in the day, it was almost seen as totally worthless to try and use shields, but now everybody's about doing it. I mean, I guess the risk-reward sort of stuff in Dead Cells really does encourage that. That if you're going to be playing this game for this long, you are going to get used to, to parrying everything. <laughs> it's, it's that nature of this game being just, one could say, too hardcore in a lot of ways, but hey, only works to its advantage. Anyway, I am good at video games. 
Right, let's go. Whew. Whoa, Nelly. Oh. I still gotta go. I mean, I gotta, like, go through and just get good at all the bosses. Obviously, on some of them, I don't really... Oh, fancy. Oh, impossible odds. Oh, yeah. Purposely took two times damage. What do I... What do I get? Hello? What? There's nothing in there. Uh... Can I... Anybody want to, um... Bugs? I mean, it is alpha, after all. <laughs> the reward was the experience. It was the friends we made along the way. Okay, uh... I don't, I don't know. Oh, okay. So I actually have to do these in order. Good to know. Zero boss self <laughs> It's nothing. It's like uh, it's like that one point in Guacamelee where you just get nothing. Ah, let's keep going. I wanna I wanna do like a another run like this. Why not? What are we feeling though? You know what? I think this is a saucy enough sort of sort of build that I'm feeling like I can do it. Maybe we'll see. <laughs> no promises. Double ammo on infinite. Double my infinite. Okay, well, anyway, this time, though, I still don't have anything for support. Good. Point blank, probably. Actually, you know what? Let's go Tranquility. This is definitely a weapon that could work well with Tranquility. And then, um, eh, Bob Tips, sure. It's infinite, after all. Take Wish, coward. You know, I probably should. You're right. I mean, why not? <laughs> There's also the new mutation. Yeah, we were looking at it, at it before. I didn't even... Uh, it's new, everybody. I want to remind everybody that it is new. I... Oh. Look at this saucy fellow. <laughs> oh, yeah? 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 Funny. <laughs> Very funny. Ah! That's a good bit, though. I'll, t I'll, I'll say it. It's, it's a, you know, I'll say this. It is a good, that is a good change up when it comes to, when it comes to uh, uh, this boss especially. It makes sense. <laughs> uh, good stuff. I actually will take this. Because I do think that should work with barbed tips. No new attacks? Well, I mean, <laughs> you know, I, I done not to toot my own horn, but... Do I have to go, like, change it to 5 boss cell or something? I, I kind of thought that this sort of thing would be outside of... Well, here, you know what? Let's just restart right now. I gotta, I gotta, um... I gotta go, like, change it out here, and then maybe that's gonna change it in here. I'm really not entirely sure how this works. But maybe this is what I'm looking for. Got a hand to motion twin that could have just made like five bosses in a row and called it good, but they made boss rush really cool. Yeah, I mean, it is it is more than... Yeah, it will. Okay. <laughs> what is that thing? Hmm. Um, just taking a look at my things in the background there. You like point and click adventures? I do like a good point and click adventure. I haven't played a ton of them, but I played like Monkey Island. I played... Uh... uh Day of the Tentacle... I mean, I've also played, like, a, a straight-up text-based adventures, like Zork. Not a ton of stuff, though. All right, same sort of thing. Yeah, let's get right back in here. Ah, I do like that. All right, five boss cell. And this time... Ah, you know what? Let's keep going. They the Tentacle. Yeah, that game's really good. Needless to say. <laughs> you still as overpowered as ever. Well, you know, I could go over here. I'm not sure what we got, baby. Yeah. All right. So, what are we feeling? You know, I know cards. Cards has something special. Yep. Applies a random effect on hit. Makes sense. <laughs> Checks out. And then, uh... Yeah, I don't know. Legendary cards is sick. Well, we'll see just how sick it is. 
mean, this is also just a good way. I mean, here, let's throw this on again, and then uh, maybe point blank. I mean, I do know that there is good synergy with the Corrupt of Power, I think. Like, that applies to all of the cards, and when you pull them back, too. Eh, let's try it. I don't know. Seems OP. We'll see. Oh, the nest. They, uh, apparently, it's not always the same bosses, which is interesting. Hmm. Anyway. Yeah, I mean, I'd be down with, like, playing more point-and-click adventures. I also watch a whole bunch of people playing point-and-click adventures, too, which I think is, you know. Oop. Not doing too bad for... Whoa, okay, 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 I got you. <laughs> I see, I see what you're throwing down here, video game. The electricity, yeah, the random electricity hit definitely uh, working out well for me here. Let me just make sure I'm not about to be hit by anything. The rare time where I can actually get that working. Now break the door for the stun. <laughs> okay, okay. Go. Oh, no perfect fight, but. Can't really say that I expected that. All right, for the stun again. Yeah, electricity here though. I think, needless to say, whoo, definitely working out quite. Well. Oh, barrel launcher? No, I can't take barrel. I can take barrel launcher. I just got to get rid of the the shield. <laughs> what do you need a shield for when we got barrel launcher? Of course. Uh, maybe not 200% damage on the defensive item. I feel like that sort of that sort of breaks its purpose here now, doesn't it? That's a new attack. I mean, yeah, the the wild new swings of the scythe claws are absolutely new. <laughs> Too good at video games. What can I say? Sorry to disappoint everybody. Well, I I, mean, I already got the legendary version. I. There's no point in getting- oh, come on, you're killing me here. Especially because that's like inflammable oil and everything, too. I could probably make that work. Yeah, I got burn. I don't have oil on anything. The turret's probably better than the emergency door. At some point in time, I'll have to go take the emergency door out and see if I can't get something working with it. What you got? Uh, critical stunner is over that? Nah. Anyway, yeah, 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 I like that. It's, uh, if I could get, yeah, there's nothing really good to get on it, but whatever, that's fine. No item would be better than emergency door. I wonder what getting emergency door, uh, the legendary does. <laughs> well, anyway. Ah, the ice giant, and yep, extra limbs, makes sense. Holy Christ. Wow, that, okay, 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 okay. Hey, where's this engagement there? All right, that is like not a trivial sort of fight. <laughs> okay then. God damn. Where was this engagement there? You know, I take that for good reason. Yeah, let's get a little bit of survival going. Try something slightly different. Uh, what am I feeling? What am I feeling? You didn't even have disengagement? All right, I took wish. <laughs> well, you got me. Fair enough. I'm gonna get a different shield if I could. Shovel. We'll do a shovel. Shovel is always pretty good. What am I feeling today? Increases your health is... That helps. That helps a lot, actually. <laughs> that doesn't kill me. Probably also wouldn't be even be too bad. Uh, Heart of Ice as Always attacking. Yeah, yeah, that's attacking. And uh, food's not going to show up. Well, armadillo pack is always a pretty safe bet, right? So successful parries, maybe two. Ah, you know what? I'm going to be extended healing. Extended healing is usually a pretty safe bet as well. Armadillo pack, though, might be something to, to look at. Crutch mode? Oh, whatever. Duh, look, trust me, we got plenty of time here. This is still like the A side of the channel when I'm not spending all of my time farming. <laughs> what do you got? Gross. But that's not really the thing I'm looking at. Okay, I see what you're talking about. I'm going down here. 
Oh, really? <laughs> now that's... Yeah, that makes sense. I'll say it. That checks out. <laughs> Interesting. The, 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 so am I going to get a side... Uh, yeah, okay, so we still have the... Oh, no, we just kind of... Oh, wow, really? Okay, this is like... This is like a for real sort of improvement. Actually getting to the point where you just consistently have the... You just consistently have the... Um, uh, you will be able to see the bullet hell attack. Which usually, if you're doing things right, everybody will be dancing. But you'll also just not even have the chance to get a look at that sort of thing. All right, Kari. Well, here's the thing. You still deal damage by killing tentacles, right? That's a thing. And the whole, like, drop down there is very much a, a thing now. But that doesn't really matter. All right. Even more Tento Mans coming on down here. They are the tentacle indeed. Okay. Still, though, it's just like a thousand hours in this game. Uh, yeah. Yeah, here's the thing. With I would be, like, dead already, of course, if I... If I uh, was taking tactics. But with the, with the... With the survival build that I have right now, especially with the extra health... It is very effective at keeping me alive for a quite long time. Even though this is, again, like, not one of those... It's not an ideal build for the Conjunctivius, especially. Alright. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. Please. Now we'll take the extra damage and everything here, I do believe. A good idea. Alright, now we're here, eh? Okay, now then. Whew. <laughs> really. Embarrassing. We had like a little bit better synergies going on, I think. Yeah, there you are. Come on. Come on. Come on, go down. Shovel damage is sad, unfortunately. Yeah, I don't really have like a particularly good shovel here. I'm going to have to go look for a different weapon in all likelihood. All right. And there's that. <laughs> oh, really? You didn't even give me a second there to react. Come on. And we're back to this. Yeah, I like that there's just a small drop off just to make sure that you get right in the tentacles away. <laughs> All right. Oh, come on. Man, I'm going to take, like, two potion charges here already. It's kind of embarrassing. Okay. Can I just get the potion going? Man! This is not the ideal build for this, is it? But, uh, such is the way of the world. Come on. <laughs> Man, I'm tanking a lot of hits, but eh, this is not the point in time to be trying to do this perfect. <laughs> Especially not with this sort of build. That's when I go get attack to build out. Ugh, come on now. And get that slow. Still not good enough. All right, there. Jesus. Giant killer available? Man, if it was. Let's see what we got. All right. I am willing to try out the oven axe. I don't know if that's necessarily the best, but I do already have some very, some pretty effective, um, you know, damage dealing methods going on here. It, it, I mean, stunning dealing methods, not damage dealing methods. Don't get scarecrow. Well, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Let's get like 24 here. Come on. Come on. 
Hmm. Eh, probably useful. Uh, I will take a frontline shield, though. I think that's kind of the preference anyway. Would rather have something that does, like, a little bit more stuns and whatnot, if you know what I'm saying. Tonic sounds good. Sure, I guess. Here's the Scarecrow, by the way. All right. Ah. Let's see how this goes. Will he first try? Ye old Scarecrow. Perhaps. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not, not going to say it's impossible. I'm just going to do that right now. <laughs> nice look. Oh, nice. Oh, that is an interesting combination of uh, things. <laughs> there. Oh, man. Nice. Okay. Jeez. Again. Oh, and it's also just like full size big boys. Okay, fine. <sighs> All right, man. Okay, so can you like stand directly next to him then in that case? Well, some decently difficult bosses here. Also, yeah, this is super not going to work with this weapon. Man, come on. <sighs> okay, this is just bad. <laughs> of course, I don't have the range on that. Ha! <laughs> Come on! I think I can at least do this largely. <laughs> yeah, not with the stomp. Oh, come on. Well, I don't know if that is... Also, I saw the cells kind of, like, flying way off screen there. Okay, so maybe don't go survival. Maybe I'm just gonna go a basic uh, brutality build. <laughs> I think that should work out uh, pretty effectively. Mushroom Boy betrayed? Well, I betray him all the time, to be fair. All right, what do we got? Actually, nothing particularly good. But, you know, I'll take this. This is a okay sort of build. I don't Is it really that okay? It's really not. <laughs> but it's okay enough. Give me that. Uh, Yeah. Because here's the thing. It's like, I'm not going to be. That's a shame. Well, I mean, at least we're seeing a good amount of bosses right now. Just like the legendary sickles. Yeah, I saw that too. Wish would also be something to take in, I suppose. All right. The twin mechs. <laughs> I don't know why I tried to roll through that, but whatever. <sighs> Come on now. Mm-hmm. I hate having the assault shield out. The shield is bad, by the way. I want to make that clear. <laughs> right. Yeah. Ah, oh, come on. You know what? I'm going to restart this. Give me a decent melee weapon already. Oh, running Vengeance Recovery recently. It's a really good combo. I can see that. Lamau. Well, I mean, and what is I gonna go use? The shovel again? Was I gonna go use the uh the the trident? Come on, I need something a little bit better than that. Well, we'll see if it's worse. Hey, hey, hey. hit me again. Alpha and everything. Okay. Go back here. Oh, <sighs> Funny because it gets worse, does it though? Does it really? Alright, I'm gonna go with this one more time. 
gonna go with, yeah, yeah, there we go. That's a good combo. Now that's a combo and a half. That's a combo you can go and show your mom. Now then. Uh, well, actually, no, not combo. Wait, how do you... How do you reset mutations? Well, okay, I guess we're going with this then. <laughs> All right. Oh, and of course, it has to be the flying one that flies. Ah. Well. It's too bad the, uh... Okay. It's too bad the uh, reset mutations didn't seem to be working there. What? Oh, come on. Well, at least this should be a little bit more effective, comparatively. And honestly, it's like... Ah. Actually getting, like, health back by killing the tentacles here, it seems. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Man, it is hard to dodge roll through all, every one of these things. But that's okay. Eh, I got it figured out for the most part. This boss is so annoying, Melee. That's true. Extraordinarily true. Okay. No, didn't quite get that there. Man, they really want me to fight all these tentacles, I guess. Come on. Which I can do. Make no mistake on that. It is possible. Not only possible, but very probable. Yeah. Look, it does... That, that's the whole thing. It's just like with melee, you can just focus on the tentacles. Because it deals damage to the boss regardless. Okay. All right. Cut that out. Let me get a few more free hits in on here. Besides, as you can see, as you can see, <sighs> come on now. Oh, gosh, really? Focusing too much on everything that I'm not supposed to be focusing on anyway. God, I'm actually getting to the point where I can't really talk during the uh, the fights here. Who could have guessed? I mean, all it would take is the super bosses. Okay. Good old adrenaline doing me a lot of good. Okay, get that kick in there. Oh, really? That was enough to get me hit? That too? Alright, fine. Arr. Oh, another inferno. That's me. Ah! I mean, I guess, you know, really, it's just like more of a firebird than an inferno. The, the inferno, of course, is, yeah, a, uh, a secondary sort of name to the, the doctor and firebird. At least until I get sued by Ponty, I can have to change my name. Hasn't happened yet. Just got to get more, um, just got to go get more uh, popular before that happens, right? That's all it takes. And then all the car companies are lined up to sue you. Happy Honda days, no more. Okay. Let's call yourself Spicy Bird and be done with it. I'm just gonna go change my I'm just gonna I'm just gotta change it to my real name, Kickflick Johnson. But I I don't think anybody wants to watch a guy named that. That would be silly. Alright, okay. Oh. <sighs> Alright. Pontiac went bust a decade ago. Then I... Well, how much do you think it costs then to get the, the Firebird name? Because it's got to be up for sale. It's probably just like... It's probably just like owned by... By like some insurance company or something. But it's just like, oh, yeah. 
you know, all stake bought the the firebird name and they got it you know sitting in some sort of like lost file cabinet somewhere we'll give it to you for five bucks it's right next to like the rights to hostess hostess like i don't know um ding dongs and uh the brothers flub <laughs> acro the acrobat yeah, that's what they got. They got Acro the Acrobat. Okay. General Motors. Eh, maybe. I don't like how many potion charges I'm using here. I hate that he keeps dropping the thing. Alright. Well, whatever. You can just focus on tentacles again. It's one of the handy things with the conjunctivious fight. The tentacles do still deal damage to the balls. Okay. I mean, adrenaline is actually working out pretty well, all things considered. I'm not too disappointed in that, at least. Enough stuns to really make this work, too. She don't like, she don't like, she don't like adrenaline. Oh, okay. And almost there. Ah, <sighs> boy. The extra speed on top of this, too, also making it uh, an entire thing just onto, its, onto itself. Well, at least with this sort of... Almost there, I think. Oh, really? <laughs> Fine. I don't even know why I'm doing anything except for focusing on tentacles. That's clearly the way to go with this. There we go. Jeez. <sighs> Bullet hell dodging with tentacles is just obnoxious. This is definitely the point in time that having something like a coon would have really come in handy. I gotta say. Because maybe more than anything else, it is a... It is a 360 degree sort of way to block bullets. So, there's something to be said about that. All right, boss is a super tanky and five boss cell. This one especially feels like it really takes forever. Eh, you know, it is uh, It is alpha. I don't know if that means they're going to end up changing it eventually or something, but could be. Could be the case. Poison's the enemy 100% burning. Oh, yeah, sure. I'll give it the old college try. In the meantime, just, just do this. Can I reset my mutations already? I can. Thank you. Yeesh. Well, first off, and then, I mean, unless I'm fighting the, uh, the Hand of the King, but I still think that's probably worth it just by itself. Uh, what else, though? You know what? Just keep giving me adrenaline. Adrenaline's probably gonna be a major way that I end up, uh, that I end up healing. Execution probably would have been good for that fight, you're right. There's, uh, there's definitely something, something about that that could work out quite well. Still, though, I do think this is one of those things where I'm gonna have to, like, go train up. We're gonna have to go do some... Real long streams at this rate to get used to the new bosses. Meet the new boss. It's actually not the same as the old boss. It's quite different. Hey, look, when you have a faster weapon, it's actually a lot more effective. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Ooh. I gotta be more careful with some of these things, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Well, worked out well, a little bit better. Maybe play it less than the highest difficulty possible. Yeah, but you saw what it looks like when it's when it's on like zero boss cell mode. It's boring. I'm kind of surprised that you changed it there. I thought that it was going to be something that you built up to eventually. You know, that sort of thing. All right. Hey, you know what? You know what? That's also a pretty good combo. Maybe not the secondary items. Secondary items are kind of junky. However, the first two items, pretty good, I'd like to say. Uh, any synergies? Electricity? No. So... 
Because I'm still going to go uh, Vengeance here, and then, oh, I don't know, Disengagement. Pretty safe bet. Ah. Third boss dash door actually seems easier because they're not modified. Huh. Interesting. Well, I guess we'll see that. As it is, though, back to the Conjunctivious fight. The only fight you ever need. It's the only one. By the time I'm done with this, I'll actually be above 50% malaise, and that'll make this a lot easier. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Come on. Now, I mean, it's like, I think I got a basic flow down of how I want to do this. You know? Which is to say, you know, working on the uh, car wash, baby. Uh, no, the uh, focusing on the tentacles. I think it's going to be a little bit more effective in terms of stuff. <laughs> good, good, good job, me. Really, really nailed it there, you know. <laughs> Come on. Adrenaline, though. Not doing too bad. You know, a little bit of stuff here and there. But You know, also, like, recovery would probably be pretty good in uh, these fights. I think overall... I mean, I want to kind of get down to, like, less than half health. That is, like, maybe not even a bad thing right now, all things considered. <laughs> but still. Okay. All right. What are the enhanced servants like? I don't know. They, they're the exact same. <laughs> they just got a different color. There we go. Yeah, 50% at less. 50% health is okay for right now. And then I'm going to kind of like uh, be going back and forth there, I guess, is the plan right now. Oh, actually, to this part. Okay. Come on, you're dead. You're dead. Accept it. Are there any more tentacles you want to throw out here? Yes, you do. Not fast enough, though. Throw them out faster so that I can do this. Right. Just gotta go look for the tentacles here. There we are. <laughs> okay, then fine. You gotta remember that you're not really safe at any point in time. There we go. I'm gonna do this though. As much as I'm probably a little bit loath to do that so whole thing, it's worth it. Oh come on! <laughs> he dropped me down there. I feel like that was a little bit unfair. Okay. Ah. Get that bleed. Get a couple bleed stacks here. That's what I need. I need the bleed. I've got a need. A need for bleed. I'm gonna let it bleed. If you need somebody to bleed on, just bleed on me. There we go. That works out pretty good, if I do say so myself. And I do. Whoa, orange. <laughs> That's right, shiny conjunctivious. Uh, you know, you'd use your ultra ball. Don't use the master ball. That's a waste. But, like, ultra ball, definitely. <laughs> right? Uh. Okay. Almost there. God, it is so ridiculous. Good old remix bosses. Every single time I think of remix bosses, I do think of, of course, uh, I don't even know why I went in on that. That was completely unnecessary. Uh, every single time I think of remix bosses, I always think of, uh, yeah, the ones um, in Rogue Legacy. 
Oh, I, I still, I, I tried when I was playing Rogue Legacy 2 to go back to Rogue Legacy 1, give an attempt on some of those bosses, but man, oh man, is it not easy. Those things are, hmm, not bad. Those things are for real. Of course, it, 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 it's not helped by the fact that the controls in the original Rogue Legacy are maybe not the best. The only thing I know about Pokemon is the Vaporeon copy pasta. Really? That's the only one. How many encounters? Oh, I did the I did the the shiny farming. So you know. Oh. Well, no. Well, no. Well, no. Hello from Superior, Wisconsin. Oh man, you're really high up there, right next to to Michigan there. Backpack it. I mean, am I gonna be able to even use it most of the time? That's ill-advised. <laughs> well, that's my middle name. Actually, my middle name is Inferno. Yeah, so that is my name as well as my... Ah, uh, yeah, I should have seen that coming from the fact that it was red. Well, what do we got now? Frantic Sword was so sick before the malaise changed, and it was also really good with old vampirism. Well, not when it shines, and it's not legendary. I mean, I, I don't... It, it seems pretty good here. And my middle name is from. Yeah, that makes sense. I love your software company. Well, I like your software company. I was so, I, mean, I was not as huge of a fan of... I was not as huge of a fan of Elden Ring as everybody else, as we all know. Boo! Boo! Not quite sure what the difference is yet. <laughs> and there, I like the cells just ascend to heaven whenever you die. Oh. This goes two times as ham, haven't gotten the last phase. I mean, it seems like all the remixed bosses are like twice as fast or so, give or take. Like, that is, that is a thing. Ugh, what do I want here of any of this? Not, like, I'm not, I'm not really feeling like any of these builds. Maybe Wrench and Whip. I mean, we can see Taunt. See how this thing works. Fight like a cow. Speaking of Monkey Island. <laughs> yeah. Ugh, flawless because you never get hit. I mean, it does seem like that's probably an effective way to do stuff, right? Gold plating, eh. Um, eh, I mean, there's always gold plating plus... No, that's stupid. The thing I'm thinking is stupid. What else? What else? What else? What else are we feeling? Vengeance, I feel like, is just... You know, vent... Hmm. Still think recovery might be good. TK seems brutal. I mean, they, they all seem pretty brutal, I'm gonna say. TBH Hemorrhage. Hemorrhage is good. Hemorrhage is a good item. I do like that. Okay, okay. Be a little bit careful here. I like it that it is the um, the icon for like the boss. Oh, almost rolled right into that one. And then I did. <laughs> All right. Okay, okay, okay. This is not too bad. Yeah. Scary, though. Yeah, okay. <laughs> what are you waiting for the music cues? Probably. <laughs> Ah. Well, at least the stun actually is, like, not even doing too bad in terms of keeping the Mama Tick away from me for right now. Gah! That was confusing me with the, the, the marks. This is not that ha half bad. No, this could be way worse, all things considered. Okay, there we go. Now, oh, of course... Yeah, I do know how to dodge that attack. It's not the easiest. There we go. Thank you, Execution. <laughs> execution seems pretty good for this particular mode, I'll say it. <laughs> I can see that this is not one of those items that uh, scales very well with stats. 
Probably the easiest of the first bosses. I mean, certainly the extra stuff, but yeah. Like, com when we're talking about having more stuff going on, compare that to, I don't know, the Conjunctivius. <laughs> Taunt, what does that do? Well, it does exactly what you think it is. Take 75% da more damage from melee attacks, causing enemies to pursue. Doesn't cause them to deal extra damage, though. Which is, oh, bone. Take that. You know, speaking of also, like, a lot of bosses with stuff going on, <laughs> Skull absolutely had that, too. It also does funny animation. And no cooldown. So, yeah, if we ever get that one, um, that one bug where, where the cooldowns are taken from the opposite item or something so that you can just infinitely use things, this would be a good candidate to use with that. <laughs> Remember that? That was fun. The Hunter's Grenade. All right. Uh, hook hand against TikTok. Against car door hook hand. Oh my god, it's just like. Ah, <laughs> uh, I think I should probably just stay away. The pursuing. Ah. Uh. I can't even just go find a good place to heal at this point. I mean that bone. Nothing left but the bones. Okay, I gotta figure out a better way to approach that, I guess. <sighs> yeah, not quite enough. Now, of course, I'm getting Wombo comboed by the uh, Mushroom Boy. Okay, you know what? If I go back into the wall... Not bad. <laughs> okay, less less good. Pretty bad. Okay, it, we're now at a point where it's just, like, pretty bad. Alright, alright. I can attack the mushrooms myself to make them sort of self-destruct, which might not be a bad idea. I'll say it. Alright. And then... To the wall! There we go. Okay. This is... Uh, mostly acceptable. Cannot get the spiker out of there! Ah! Okay. Okay. All right. <sighs> really? <sighs> oh. Again, melee attacks not working super well with this entire thing. Really? Disengagement must be the play? No way is disengagement the play. Disengagement still has the issue, of course, of, you know, you have to kill the boss then, and you don't really get the choice as to how many stats you have. So, you know. That whole thing. Oh, what are we looking at here? What's good? What's good? I can always try using the whip. Telling you recovery is so good? Oh, yeah, I mean, I would think so. I mean, I, I did, haven't I said that, like, met, uh, several times at this point? That said, since he told me to took it as an act of, as an act of, uh, protest, I will not do it. So, ah, uh, uh, and in fact, I will never take recovery again now. Uh, opinions on the new items? I haven't been able to find, the, well, I guess I haven't really been using the correct stuff for the rune thing yet, but... I don't know about Taunt. Frankly, I gotta get used to the bosses a little bit more before I can give any sort of real opinion on it. That one's kind of a hard one to roll through. That shed is like, all things considered... <laughs> Really. All things considered, this does seem like the one of the better of the first bosses. Maybe not the easiest sort of one to perfect. 
Especially if you roll into enemies accidentally. But definitely still doable. Okay, okay. Yep. Gotta, I can't go too heavy on the hits there, after all. Gotta, gotta also make sure that I'm not getting locked into a single strike with these guys here. All right. Ugh. My eyes are getting dry. I have them open so much. Almost, but not quite. Nah, frankly, it's just like should be able to manage. Oh, ah. got distracted by the boss being executed. All right. Hey. Okay, anything else I'm feeling like taking here? Hard to say. I mean, I don't know. Give me Telerik Shock. Why not? Corrosive Cloud is generally not super amazing. And then, um... Eh? Stun Target, Frozen, not good enough. Okay, is this possible to play this with custom? Yeah, it should be. Can't really... Can't really imagine any reason why it wouldn't be, right? Eh, we'll see. Oh, in the meantime, I think this is probably going to be the last try before I immediately... Sure, I like this item. Uh, before I immediately go back and start playing Stardew Valley again. So look forward to it. Stardew Valley, that is. Um, This, I don't know. I, Man. Give, why, why this boss? We saw the giant and we saw the timekeeper once. <laughs> And it's just, hey, baby, here comes here comes the Scarecrow over and over. Oh, what's that? The the second tier boss you're the worst at? Oy. Go deep sea fishing? I did get deep sea fishing. Did that during the uh, midnight fair or whatever it is. Got some spooky fish. They're spooky. Yeah, execute that thing instantly. Okay, I actually have some things to take care of the... Take care of the ads a little bit better. Okay, what I gotta do is I gotta roll and then roll again. Two big rolls, baby. That's how you do it. That's how you do the video game. It'll be like going to a restaurant. You're gonna get some rolls. Am I right? Am I right, ge fellow gamers? Okay. <laughs> that is a, such a hard... Such a hard... Um, attack to dodge. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna do all of them. Yeah, we're just gonna do all of them. Okay. Execute for good times. Okay, we have a good. Ah! All over the place here. Yeah, didn't want to go for one more. Okay, you know what? I tried to just... Whatever. The game's not gonna <laughs> pay any heed to my complaints right now. At least I can destroy both of those immediately. <laughs> Fine. All right. Ah, oh, still though. Get out of the way so I can kill this thing. There. Yo, oh, right into the mushroom. All right. Oh. Doesn't actually seem to work with uh, custom mode. You're bad. You're banned. 
And he morphed all over that guy. All right, Scarecrow not only has no HP, usually. Well, we'll get another chance to fight him right here. Don't worry. Oh, uh, what do we feel? Yeah, you know what? I like this as a combo. And you know what? I like this more as a combo. Okay, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. You're banned. <laughs> That's what you are. Tactics with electric whip? Uh, tactics. <laughs> what do you want tactics? And... Disengagement, probably good. I'm going to take that inside, though. Frankly, I shouldn't be uh, healing too much as it is. Ah. That's the sort of life I lead right now, after all. If the Moon ha Festival hasn't already passed... I mean, yeah, but it has already passed. Actually passed in the uh, last stream. I'm currently in spring of the second year of, of Stardew Valley, by the way. Hope you all are enjoying that series, by the way. Fortunately, uh, fire combo that I have is not really going to be super effective right now. Which is a real tragedy. And this should be working out fairly effectively, though. Well... Now, to provide that I can actually hit the boss. Uh, okay. Okay, okay. Come on now. Hey, thank you, Honest. I love you. You're also just talking about, um... Ah! Remixed bosses in... Remixed bosses in, uh... That one game. Rogue Legacy. The Legacy of Rogues. Okay. We'll get some uh, healing here. Survival and shields. I mean, survival and shields are definitely still very effective. Well, one's not going to argue with that. And by one, I mean me. I'm the one. It's me. Wario. <laughs> so in me. Uh, uh. This is like the easier of the bosses. Okay, please. Please love me too. No, you got banned. Okay. How many times do I need to say this? Oh. oh, come on. You should know the proper way to say that in German. As we all know, Wario, at least at that point in time... Ugh. Oh, yeah, I don't have a shield. <laughs> was German. All right. Uh, it's true. I'm living a life where I'm now just shadow banning people randomly. Oh! I mean, I, well, I think I probably want to keep the, the combo that I have right now, though. Of course, uh, Hayabusa Gauntlets would not be a terrible thing to have. Eh, sure. Probably a little bit more effective than this one right now, anyway. <sighs> you know what? Let's just see what we got here for the second uh, <laughs> the second boss, then. I mean, I'll tell you what it is right now. It's a, it's the, it's a Scarecrow. Ugh. All right, give me some more stats. All right, Impaler 2, not bad, but not good enough. 100% I'm burning oil, obviously going to be good. Going to be effective. Going to be saucy. Oh, hey, here we go. Fortunately, I don't have the... I Maybe mean, I should switch back to the uh, the shield. Usually a little bit more effective in this fight, except I didn't take it. <laughs> Could have just thrown it in the backpack, but I didn't. All right. Yeah, fortunately with no shield, I think I'm going to be a little bit, uh... Going to be a little bit not great. It's especially when I, I don't actually heal from using the potion. Ah, Should have taken the shield. I totally forgot that there are other bosses than the Scarecrow that exist in the game. <laughs> Reasonably so, though. Ah. All right. And try that one again. See what we got. Uh, da, 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 da. Could start kicking. I'm not going to kick, though. Here, yeah, this is a little bit less dependent on me being able to melee every one of the enemies. A little bit. Like, not really. It's not even that much less dependent. But fire is less of a thing then. So, you know. And uh, here, let's just take disengagement. Probably going to be useful. Oh, yeah, which is good, because, yeah, it's, it's back into the nest again. What is bussin'? Have you never heard of bussin'? Come on. 
Really? You Zoomers. I'm older than everybody here. That's probably not true. But it's probably also not untrue. It's the dichotomy of man. This is this is what the dichotomy of man is, trust me, I know. I would know. I'm just gonna punch this eyeball for a while. As you do. Bah. There we are. Oh we'd like to see in future dead cells any sort of content. I am not picky. I mean, I always, I always take the, uh, I always take the viewpoint of just like whatever Motion Twin feels like doing, I'll play it. Of course, because I mean, I don't know. I, I always feel like whatever I'm going to say, I would rather have it be the people making the damn game who, ah, probably know a lot better than me. Yeah. Okay. Oh boy. Game is mature at this point. I mean, y'all say it's mature. It's it's uh, five years old. <laughs> Not a whole lot of games that you have that are uh, staying power. Roguelites, though, do have the potential. I think a little bit more than other genres, unless they're online or something. <laughs> I should have just went for the shield. All right, forge redone with higher tiered weapons. That feels like I, yeah. I feel like the uh, you can already get like a run. Okay. Can already get a run working so effectively. Oh yeah, I actually got the parry there. Cancel that thing right out. Being a Hollow Knight Geometry Dash TF two. <laughs> I'll read that in a second. <laughs> I'm not about to get moitalized. There we go. Hey, thank you, Hyper Dad. Welcome to the jam. I hope you enjoy your stay here while I still fumble around trying to... Oh, it's weird. It's been a while since Dead Cells, you know. It's completely unknown in a lot of ways to me. Okay, being Hollow Knight, Geometry Dash, and TF2 fan, it's nice. Surprise seeing so much love from the Dead Cells dev devs. Yeah, TF2 has been... Um, uh, been they, they ended that like a couple years ago now at this point, right? Geometry Dash, I'm not as sure about... Yeah, sure. Uh, Geometry Dash, I'm not as sure about. I really don't know anything about that game. But uh, Hollow Knight. <laughs> hey, we have confirmed that Silk Song is an extant game that does actually exist. So there's something. <laughs> as it turns, it, it is a, it, it does have a, a presence in the world, not physically, but you know. All right, here we go. Finally, a little bit more different shield. Still going to be as effective as ever. I'm thinking. This is so goofy. <laughs> oh, yeah, the combo there is, is something, isn't it? Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to be a little bit more careful than not. Ah! Ice giant. Okay, just got to make sure that I'm paying attention to everything that's going on here. That's good. I mean, one of the greatest things about Dead Cells is the fact that they have... Man, really. You know, frankly, if I know that I'm going to be fighting this guy, I should probably take the... Uh, flash damage on... Trap stuff. Because that is a good way to negate a lot of the damage you get from the crystals, of course. Nice try. Ah, they did get me there, though. So I missed Oh, great. There's a super attack. Oh, well, I mean, there was a super attack coming, but then I just... I artfully just... Totally... Man. Really do not uh, have an easy time here with a lot of this stuff. Okay, really. I think I'm getting a little bit used to the patterns that I want to actually execute here at this point. <laughs> That's fun. Mm. 
Okay, really now? Oh, and I'm out of potion charges. Oh, no, I had that. I had the parry. Come on. When do you get a second set of arms? Oh, this is a, a sh the shiny giant. I fought the giant um, like a thousand times before. This one, we finally got the shiny one. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. Giant is my favorite boss. It's a, cool, it's a cool boss. I like him. All right. Yeah, sure. Okay, this is the last try here. And then I might... Uh, then, yeah, back to Stardew. Cursed sword, do it. Was there a cursed sword? I didn't even see. Are you sure? I don't think the cursed sword exists. Pretty sure you're lying about that. All right. Ah. Well, and is DC the only game Motion has developed? Oh, they, they developed a bunch of uh, mobile games before. Can't really say I'm too familiar with them. <laughs> How about the new item? I mean, that's uh, its tactics. So, no. <laughs> Good uh, parry there. There we are. <laughs> Keep trying to get the parry and it's just not working out. I should just go for the dodge, of course. Clearly the more effective strategy after all. Alright. I tried. Ah. I mean, I saw the tentacle coming there, too. I knew it was going to happen. There we are. There we go. Can't win without taking chances. Yeah, you can. What are you talking about? What do you think risk is the only determining factor for success in life? That's absurd. Like unless you're ga unless you made all your money by gambling, that's ridiculous. Chad, have you made all of your money by gambling? Are you investing in Bitcoin? You have to tell me. I'm your father. I will not. We are not crypto. We are not a cryptocurrency household chat. I looked under your bed the other day. I looked under your bed and you know what I found? I found NFTs. I found I found a hideous image of, of, of a, a monkey down there. Can you excuse that? Oh, don't tell me that you're taking up drawing now. Okay, this is stupid. Uh, anyway, I know that's a lie. See how your see how your fingertips are are uh, stained with zeros and ones. I got nothing. Okay, anyway. Uh Okay, okay, okay. A working class broke boy. That's what they all say. I mean, what do I mean that's what they all say? <laughs> Uh, all right. Now well, then, what the updates they have coming out in 20... Ah! 2023. <laughs> Man, all the recent DC updates have been pretty good. They sure have. I mean, I'm, of course, looking forward to any sort of, like, really big uh, new content stuff here. Gog! But anyway, uh, what was I talking about here? Yes, I mean, everybody here is... Everybody here is a working man. He's a simple kind of man. Kind you... No one understand. Including myself. When you think I... You think I'm... You think I'm big internet man for money? No, no, no. This is just a side hustle, baby. So that I can afford all those hideous pictures of apes. <laughs> That's not true. I would never be able to afford one of those. They're incredibly expensive. Uh, but... What were we talking about again? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I work an hourly job. I'm cool, kids. I'm approachable. Vote for me for Congress. Oh. Tertiary hustle. <laughs> There's so many hustles. Like, surely I can just work on, like, the first two hustles before I start to work on my tertiary and quadrinary hustle. <laughs> Look, trust me, trust me. When I get the septenary tuss, when I get the septenary or octogenary hustle, that's that's when we're gonna be in the big money. That's when I'm gonna start to afford all the hideous apes. 
<sighs> anyway, <laughs> what am I talking about here? I, I, I don't know what's happening. I'm just like saying things as I'm trying desperately to not take too much damage in this fight. Okay. Also, I think I snuck a Leonard Skinner reference in there somehow, which is weird. But whatever. You know what? It works. Okay. Hey, Yulia. How are you doing today? Join Stardew Valley? <laughs> you have to tell me. Uh, that's You're legally obliged to tell me that you're enjoying Stardew Valley if you're entering the stream. We're fighting shiny bosses, I guess. And of course, doing it on the hardest difficulty possible because I'm no weakling. No weakling. You are, and I. I don't care if it takes 10 hours to beat the tree sentinel. I'll do it. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, well, only one potion down. I'll take it. Ooh, I would take a. Uh, Baron's Lantern something. That's a fun item. I don't think it's worth giving up the shield and everything, though, so that's not gonna happen. Did it really take you 10 hours? No, it took a different streamer that I watched 10 hours to do that. <laughs> right out the gate. Right out the gate that led over to the stupid cathedral. You are and I. Oh. Anyway. Okay. Took me like 10 hours to fight, um. Did take me like 10 hours to fight, uh, Melina, though. Did do that. Never made that into a video because, you know, it's, um, <laughs> it's horrible. <laughs> like, I don't think I got any, I don't think I got any usable footage out of there. We have stuff happening here. Oh, God, yeah. Oh, current events. Wait, Cyberpunk is good? Yeah, apparently they fixed it up. That's what I hear. I don't know if I'm... Like, I still haven't even played the third... I still haven't even played the third, um... Witcher game. Played the first two. And I was just like, ah, you know what? The good one? Forget about that. I would rather... Have, I, I'm, I'm satisfied playing the one built on the Neverwinter Nights engine. <laughs> ah! Okay. God, I should just, like, you know, full full shield. <laughs> nice try, though. What's going all on here, eh? Oh. All right. Eh, well, disengage and stuff, so might as well. Okay. There we are. Boss rush mode? Yep, Alpha's out for it right now, and that's what we're doing. Hence the uh, hence the dumb title of the stream. Man. Nope. 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 I know how to parry stuff, by the way. I just don't most of the time. It's a holdover from doing all those challenge runs. All right. Fine, whatever. It takes a minimal amount of damage to get hit by the... Also, I do notice that she appeared to have gotten her health back for this final phase, which is pretty pogtastic, I gotta say. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> you know, just have the shield right up there, you know? There we go. Ugh. This is a fight and a half. <laughs> oh. 
Okay, now. Oh, no, I'm out. All right, almost there. <laughs> almost there. Oh, man. I can't see anymore, though. That is kind of a problem. Ah! Come on! <laughs> ah, you're getting me! My God! <laughs> well, so close. Good run. I mean, yeah, it's like... Uh, that is definitely... I mean, I, f I feel like ugh, just going full on with a shield is definitely the best way to be able to take out the second tier bosses and probably the third tier bosses but like jesus oh man she healed to 100 percent. yeah i didn't even notice that uh until like i had enough of a break to just to just like glance my eyes over at that part of the screen again <laughs> oh my boss sells tough it's a toughen. so oh man whoa nelly well i guess we'll, we'll do more of that later on then <laughs>